Do you know what the Prophet, peace and blessings be upon him, looked like? They were of medium height. Their colors were white and red and their faces were weeden. They were leaning forward. Between the two shoulders was wide, with palms and steps full of fur. Their heads were big, their faces were rounder and their faces were black. The joint of the bones is wide. His eyelashes were long and his body parts were well proportioned. Long and thin hair from chest to navel. Contributions are free. If they turned to any side, they would be wolves with their bodies. Broad foreheads. His brows were not furrowed. Their noses are high pointed. His beard was thick. The teeth were small and shiny. The front teeth could be seen separately from each other. Belly and eyes are flat and equal. Broad breasts. Long wrists. Between the two shoulders there is a seal of prophethood. This seal was a reddish pink top shape like a pigeon's egg. They walk fast. They used to greet everyone first. His hair fell halfway between his ears. They combed their hair and dyed it black and red and sometimes it was different. They wanted to start from the right. They did their hair. Those who took Hajj and Umrah. They poured antimony into their eyes every night. They wore the clothes until they fell off. Those whose rings are made of silver and wear them on the right hand. They beat turban seven or twelve times. Signs have not gone below the soil. They did not eat food leaning. If they did not blame the food, they would leave if they did not like it. After eating, they licked their fingers three times. They did not eat on the couch. The food was chicken, mutton, pork, vinegar, olive oil, barley bread, sliced bread, yellow date flour. They loved sweet and cold drinks, milk, and bowls. It was made of wood. They mixed cucumber and melon with fresh dates. When they drank water, they took three breaths. There were special containers for spices. If they pointed to something, they would point with their whole palms. Had seven swords. They used to read and listen. The poets are Hassan ibn Thabit. First they would pray two rockets of light prayer and then start to hajj it. They recited each verse clearly and clearly. They liked to hear the Quran from others. The skin of the muscles was covered with palm bark. The companions did not get up to meet him. Wherever they went, they would sit in an empty seat. His time at home was divided into three. One prayer, two household chores, three personal chores. They used to do everything in advance. They did not take food for themselves for the morning. They looked after their own clothes, mended their own clothes, and milked the animals themselves. They did not wear yellow clothes. They did not hit anyone. When they themselves lived as dervishes, their gifts were better than those of the branches. They took gifts and gave rewards. They distributed the gifts to the needy on the day they arrived. They could easily see the distance that no one could see even if they could hear their distant sounds. They could see easily in the dark as well as during the day. They used to speak concisely and eloquently at the same time. They swam according to everyone's mind. He did not lie in his jokes. Their laugh was a beautiful smile. After recognizing the person they saw at first, everyone loved him. Those who rode camels. Those who performed Hajj once and Umrah four times. They ate little and slept little. They did not take revenge for themselves. When he died, Hazrat Ali, may Allah be pleased with him, performed ghusl. His uncle Abbas and his sons helped him. Graves were dug by Abu Talha. Give your inheritance as alms.